Lisa, I'm telling you when, you, when you start talking about chilly temperatures, that starts, you know, getting me thinking about chili. And we got a lot of that here. The Gooseberry Patch ladies are joining us live in the uh, studio this morning. Uh, we have Vicki Hutchins and Joanne Martin with the Gooseberry Patch ladies. Always great to see Thank you. you. Thank Thanks you. so much for coming Thank on you. this morning. Chili. Mm. What better food when the temperatures perfect. start dropping, perfect right? Day. It's nice and hearty. What, what makes chili the perfect cold weather food? It's comfort food. You can reheat it. It's better the next day. Mm -hmm. It transports it is, well. It? And you yep. know what? It mixes and matches with corn. Corn bread, corn pudding, corn biscuits. So it's just a hearty yeah. and and you can make it your own by whatever kind of cheese you want to top and it with. And people take or pride in their chili. Absolutely, don't they? all these I mean, cook-offs oh, and yeah. contests. Yeah, people winning cook-offs by taking shortcuts. Yes, we, we've <laughs> it's heard not that. Not uh -huh. bird, so it's, we've yeah. heard that. And you can garnish it however you like. We've got jalapenos. We've got oh, this is just awesome. We've got cheese. Mm -hmm. You're talking about like these, uh, you know, massive fiesta cornbread. Like you said, a little bit of spice mm. to it. Uh, the chili and the biscuits and stuff. But comfort. Corn pudding. Okay, yeah. that's what we're, we're going to make that yes. to go so kind of the you, accompaniment. And okay, and yes. it's real easy. So. Okay, so yes. what do we have to do? We we're have, gonna, we have we're all gonna, this stuff Yeah, here. you want to just dump that into the just bowl. Just dump the corn in. Whole corn, kernel corn. Sweet corn. Mm -hmm. Okay, get that in. And then we get have cream corn. And these cream ingredients corn. are and really, you know, corn. just mm -hmm. canned. They're not fresh. It makes it nice and easy. Very easy. We've got sour cream, of course. All righty. That gives it nice moistness. And then butter. All right. Okay, we're going to mix that up. Would you like to do that? So I'm mixing that up there. And we're going to mix the, that up really well, and then we're just going to add the uh, corn muffin mix. You got your old standby, Jiffy. Yes, exactly. Good stuff. Just mix it up. Oh, this is good. We're going to pour it into a 13 by 9 pan. That's already been sprayed, ready to go. 375 for about 30 to 40 minutes. Okay. And this is kind of what it turns out like when you're finished with exactly. it. Exactly. That's just awesome. It's that easy. And this it's, is it's, easy. It's, Even I could do this. It's a great side dish with uh, it's messy, uh, but... turkey or ham or meatloaf or sloppy joes. Or, you know, we were saying yesterday you could add mm -hmm. some canned jalapenos in there or some. Just add a little kick to yeah, it. Yeah, absolutely. Whatever, whatever oh, it is that, that you is really perfect. like. All right, so now, it's awesome. You... So we were talking chili. Now, I know the Gooseberry Patch yes. ladies, you have your, uh, your top five chili recipes. Um, we do. We have the, uh, the number one, your, your favorite one. Somewhere around here, we've got white chicken chili. Is this one right? All right, absolutely so it's this, this amazing. This one over here on my left, mm -hmm. white chicken mm -hmm. chili. Is there any way I can get a taste of this? There is. Here's a spoon. And Look you know at that. Right How you can just convenient. dig right in. Well, and those little bowls right yeah. there, we've garnished it for you because we've got corn chips, the brown bowl right there. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. We've added a little sour cream. So this is it right here. Yeah. Just a little bit of, a yeah. little bit of everything in it. Yes. And why? Why is this your number one favorite chili? Do you think people think they're being healthy by using chicken or maybe, something? Maybe, it's or maybe because it's a little different than than just mm. your normal chili. That's it's amazing. It is absolutely amazing, and I think probably it's the sour cream and cheese. Of course, that it's makes really it everybody good. Loves. I love the yeah. little bit of crunch there. Okay, so that was that was one of five chili recipes. Why don't you try the corn pudding? I'll, I'll try go the ahead corn for yeah. this. Yeah. Why don't right. you, well, you yep. help Pete scoop you that up? Yeah, right. and I'll get you like this out a, of the way. I like the corners. Do you? Sort the of corners are good. Then yeah, you get that little kind of extra crispy. bit of crunchiness there. Absolutely. Look at that. All right, now, ladies, just, if you don't, would you mind sticking around just, a yeah. little bit? No, sure. We'd be happy to. What do you think? Oh my gosh! Amazing. That's incredible. <laughs> Along with that chili, I'll tell you what. I know Lisa's over there. She wants to get in on this. So how about? Excuse me for talking about this. In the next half hour. Yeah. We'll reveal maybe the uh, the other four. That'd be great. Favorite chili recipes. Mm. We'll get Lisa in on that. Does that sound good? They're all Sounds different, great. and I think they're going to be great. Awesome. Well, Thank hey, you. the recipes for all of this stuff, including this easy to make comfort corn pudding. It's so easy, even I can do it. The recipes on myfox28columbus.com. Simple enough. Click on recipes, ladies. This is <laughs> awesome, Lisa. Wow. Pete, Carolyn's crying a little I'm bit. I'm like really pouting, so she I get to work out this morning, and you <laughs> guys get to eat chili. <laughs> How did this happen?